You have such great taste in fragrances. You really do. Thank you. Oh, this is Baby. perfect. Previously on Dear June with Peyton. This is a real black woman's kitchen. This is a real black mama kitchen, okay? Catch all this drip today. Catch all this drip today. Because I'm on my period, I'm feeling so girly and womanly, girl. Hey, from that day I never saw the point in talking to Your soulmate does not always have to be the one who's snatching your soul. Okay, so full outfit. This is what we're wearing. Top and pants from Zara, Jimmy Choo, Mules, Fendi bag. And yeah, I'm ready to meet y'all. Let's go. Make sure you're all caught up on the Dear June Diaries. And let's jump into today's diary and see what's going on. You know they say diamonds are a girl's best friend, but when you can get real diamonds for a good price, oh baby, you are definitely worthy of being my BFF. So I want to thank Blue Now for sponsoring today's video and sending over these gorgeous pair of hoop earrings, but not only that, they sent over the matching necklace as well. And I'm not going to lie, while I love costume jewelry and the affordability of it, you can get so much for the look. It doesn't last. And right now in my life, I'm looking for timeless pieces. Pieces that will last, I can shower with, I can sleep with. I don't have to worry about it tarnishing. And Blue Now offers an array of different types of jewelry, whether it's earrings, necklaces, rings, bracelets, engagement rings, wedding rings, what have you. And the price, well, I mean, you can see for yourself. Whether you're getting a tennis bracelet, which is absolutely dazzling and it features brilliant cut diamonds that never go out of style, or a pair of diamond studs, which is always a must have whether you're shopping for yourself or anyone else, a pair like this twinkles and catches the light so beautifully, perfect for dressing up or adding some sparkle to a casual outfit or a night out on the town. And don't forget an unforgettable gift with timeless appeal no collection is complete without a stunning necklace from Blue Now. I'm absolutely obsessed with the one that I have. Blue Now is an original online jeweler since 1999. Plus they have jewelry experts on hand 24 seven available via phone or chat to help you find a memorable gift at every budget. Blue Now is the place to find the perfect piece for you or anyone else with a wide assortment of jewelry of the highest quality at the best price. Now, I highly recommend Blue Now. It is definitely a 10 out of 10. And if you're looking for luxurious, timeless pieces, all you have to do is go to bluenow.com backslash Peyton and use promo code Peyton to get $50 off your purchase of $500 or more. Thanks again to Blue Now for sponsoring today's video. We are getting ready to begin. Nigga, horses don't stop. They keep going. Yeah. You can lose your life, but it's gonna keep going. Why not risk life when it's gonna keep going? Yeah. When you got somebody else was born, but at least we got to
Bottle's so cute. Yeah, so bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now this one I like. This one I like. That one will go with your good face. It smells like it'll go good with me and Tom because. Oh! Whatever, whatever, whatever is at the back. You know you like your hair. You know you like your hair. Let's go home with Mary. I haven't put it with Mary yet. So this one is new, it's Cherry Blossom, and if you already have Mir and Tonka, it's the one. Money with a cylinder. With 20 to stand on the couch, run out of town. Fuck me, feeling me. He like the way that I dress. Throwing balloons, he the flex. Like money, I got him obsessed. Them bitches see me as a threat. The baddest in the room. So tell him to make room. Diamonds glistening on my boot. They gon' listen to my tune. Flow the nicest, but I'm rude. I like niggas, bitches too. Ayo, baddie, what it do? Ayo, Maddie, what it do? <laughs> Over here smelling fragrances. Yeah, I'm putting him on. Ain't that good? Woo. Oh, this is beautiful. That dry down, amazing. How it just sit on your clothes. You have a you have a spray something on your clothes and then as you putting it in the wash, you still get a whiff mm -hmm, of it mm -hmm. and you like, what the fuck? Oh, this is beautiful. Ain't it good? This is beautiful. This is the one you got in Dubai. Mm-hmm. Mm. And you can wear that any season. Mm -hmm. Any season. What did you it pair this with so again? Kama Sutra. And what else? There was an another one. Delena. Delena. Oh, that was a that was a mean ass combo that night. I should have had a boy. I should I should have a boyfriend. Somebody <laughs> should spend the night that night, huh? T. Have you smelled B six eighty three? No, that's the one you were talking about earlier. That smell like the shiny. Mm hmm. That little bitty bottle is three hundred and eighty dollars. Oh, this smells. Is oud in it? Oh uh, yeah. Mhm. Mm oh. And saffron. Definitely smell the saffron. Oh, this is beautiful. Ain't it good? Mhm. Mm Don't it smell like saffron colonies by Nishani? It does, but like deeper and richer. Mhm. Mm three hundred dollars in it. Three eighty. This is also from Dubai, or like? No, you can get that on Twisted Lily, but I sold it out. Wait, this is the one I want to smell. The one that you keep talking oh, about. Oh, yeah, platinum leather. You have such great taste in fragrances. You really do. Thank you. Oh, this is beautiful. Yeah, you can only get that in um, 
I think this Middle is Eastern countries. My um, favorite out of all of these. That's right what now. the girl said in Maldives. You can only get them in the Middle Eastern region. Beautiful. So Dubai, Doha. Oh, I just got this one too. This um, Cambridge. Yeah. Does it, doesn't it remind you of Gentle, Gentle Floyd mm -hmm. Go? And like that's it smells why exactly I won't like buy it. it. But wait till you smell this. What's that? I got this. This is the um, that body oil that I got that I've been talking about that I got a Leo. Mm -hmm. It also smells like Gentle Fluid Fluidy Go, but it's called Musky Al Rose. And it's crazy because Ooh. it don't even give me rose. Oh, I smell rose. You smell the mm -hmm. rose? It's like a soft, like a damask rose. Mm hmm This Put is nice. Put it on your skin. Put it on the other, the other yeah. hand. And it's going to stay there all night. It's still going to be on, there, on your skin after you get out of the shower. This is it. Let me smell it on you. This is it. <sighs> this is it. It's so good, right? Like it's perfectly blended. God, it's so good. Like, whew. I feel like platinum leather is what ombre leather tried to do with Tom Ford. I think that's what mm. I, I feel like that's what Tom Ford was trying to do. Even though I still love ombre leather, I love ombre but leather. This is. It smells way more expensive. Like mm -hmm. this one smells like old money. Like, but like, the leather is nice and soft. It's like mm -hmm. a buttery leather. It's mm -hmm. not like strong you you know the notes in this one <sighs> let's look it up and see if we can find it it might not even be online because when they say something is not in the united states no, it really <laughs> don't it really don't be yes friend but i want i feel like there is still even though it's it hasn't it's not made available over here it's probably a way. There are gonna, like, still fragrance it. people who have it and have reviewed it and would know the notes. So it should be somewhere. Hold on. Platinum. Oh, wow. I'm the... surprised I got milk. You surprised I got milk? Mm hmm. Commodity. It's like a creamy, like, gourmand. Um, I think you can get this on fragrance.net. No way. It's on fragrance.net. I'm buying it. That's it. Is it more expensive on there though? Uh, no. I would definitely say this is probably a, for the amount that I spent over there. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, it's worth it. Like, look at this sheen too. So oh. it says, <sighs> musky, woody, patchouli, and vanilla accords. Animal. Animalic leather and powdery jasmine are the mm -hmm. two heart notes. I smell jasmine. Earthy patchouli, sweet vanilla, and beguiling musk are the base notes grounding the fragrance in the earth and woods. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm buying that. That makes sense. It's good. Let me smell it again on you. Every time I spray it, I'd be like, why don't I wear this more? Friend. Oh, and this too, though. It's, it's, it smells Dubai, though. Don't it smell mm -hmm. like Dubai? It does. It's like it has that Middle Eastern twang to it. Mm hmm. Like, I feel like when I was in Dubai and I stayed at the V Hotel, it's this, this one. That's what I kept smelling, and that's why I kept sell, smelling. It smelled good in this hotel. I feel like I kept smelling it. Like this one, the platinum leather. Uh huh. And I kept, every time I left out of my room, I'm like, damn, this smells good in this <laughs> hotel. Because them men over there smell good, baby. I you, you been to Dubai? Mm -hmm. Man, them men no. over there smell so damn good. I'm buying this. That's all they do in the whole mile is people stop and get you to Ooh. smell different perfumes. No, I need this in my life. Booted up, turned up, piped up. I'm back, baby. Where the love, where the love at? All right. Man, this thing is heavy, okay? Heavy. Heavy, heavy. You got so heavy, baby. Let's see what Jo Malone got you, girl. Y'all, I literally, when I say literally, the last Jo Malone was last year in September. They gifted me 
this velvet rose oud um, scent diffuser it's still oil in here y'all this thing is so good I thought it was gone yeah it's still oil in here those diffusers last so long and they project okay ray came up here to smell the perfumes that i've been recently buying um out of the country and as soon as he walked my door shut as soon as he walked upstairs he said it smells good up here what is what is, what is this every floor smells different um and it had to be that because i mean i ain't have any candles lit or anything it had to be that Oh, wait, look at this big old box, y'all. Oh, wait, look at this big old box. And it is heavy. I love Joe Malone's packaging in their wrapping. Like, they literally hand wrap everything. Look at this. I didn't even know they had counters this big. Oh, I like this. This is the English Pear and Freesia Candle. Mmm, I like this. This is beautiful. And it's going to look amazing on my centerpiece. Downstairs. Downstairs. Thank you so much, Joe Malone. Tonight was amazing. You guys came out. You brought your cameras. You networked. We shopped. Um, even though it wasn't as many people as last time, a lot of people couldn't attend. A lot of people, um, pulled out at the last minute. Um, they did better in numbers this evening than last year, last September. So thank you guys again so much for coming out. Um, hopefully I will see you guys in Miami. If not, you know, it's... No big deal. There will be more Joe Malone meeting greets. They actually want to do another one in September because this one actually did better than the first one. Um, so there will be an anniversary Joe Malone meet and greet um, coming soon. So be on the lookout for that. Um, but they, yeah, they told me that they did better this time tonight than they did the previous Joe Malone meet and greet, which was my first meet and greet in Miami that will be meet and greet number three is not joe malone it is a swim miami swim week um meet and greet and it's going to be really really fun but that's just going to be a meet and greet not so much a shopping meet but thank y'all so much for coming out supporting the brand supporting me i got to speak with so many of y'all hear your stories um we cried together i mean so many of y'all gave me goosebumps I met one PayPal. When I tell you, she lit the room up. She lit the room up. She was so hilarious, so funny, so genuine. Um, and I, I really want to see her go far on this platform because I feel like her personality sticks out and her personality will be her niche. You know what I'm saying? What I was talking about earlier today in the vlog um you're you're essentially your niche you know what i'm saying like when i came on this platform y'all i promise y'all i did not know i would be where i am today i had no idea i was scared as fuck i was country as fuck i was loud as fuck i cursed a lot i was smoking you know what i'm saying um i say this all the time because i don't want people to get on here thinking that pretty privilege is how you're successful or cookie cutter is how you're successful true you will get a lot more opportunities being polished per se but what really inspired me to get on this platform and be myself was cardi b i immediately related to cardi b when i seen cardi b on love and hip-hop how she was just genuinely herself funny I said, listen, when I get on this platform, that's how I'm going to be. And I'm not going to be, I'm not saying I'm going to be Cardi B. I'm going to be who I am. It's not, hi guys, welcome back to my channel, da 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 The person that I was when I first started YouTube doing beauty related content. You never got to see my personality. Off camera, this is who I am. On camera, this is who I am. Now, given 
a lot of people don't get to see this fun side of me because I just a, a lot of people don't reciprocate their energy for me to for me to be that way. So I will say that sometimes I adapt and then other times I'm just quiet. You know what I'm saying? I can't be fake, so I'm just quiet. But I really, really love the fact that I can be myself on this platform um, and y'all enjoy it. It's entertaining. Um, you know, you watch, support, and I truly, truly appreciate y'all. I'm so grateful for y'all. I promise y'all I am. Like, it was PayPal's who told me to stop looking for a job and do this full time because y'all know when I first started YouTube well when I came back to YouTube and vlogging baby I was trying to go back to work this was not supposed to be what it is I was trying to get a job I was trying to have a career in project management baby I was outside I was going to going on interviews with my good shoes on and stockings I want to watch that video that video is so funny that video is funny as hell actually um but yeah this it wasn't the plan for me to do this full time but y'all enjoyed my video so much and this was a time when when i tell you i literally responded to every comment i when i first started vlogging i was responding to every comment not saying i don't read every comment now um i'm not always able to respond to every comment especially during daily vlogs child oh my lord i want to i try i try my best i be up late at night at four five o'clock in the morning responding to comments sometimes but um that was a time when i literally was responding to every comment and so many of my paypal so many of y'all was saying that this is what I should be doing full time and to stop looking for a job and stop going on interviews because I was becoming so discouraged with the emails of, you know, we went with another candidate, but we're going to keep your resume on file. If this, listen, go, you go watch that vlog because that vlog is very funny. I will pin it somewhere in this video so y'all can go and watch that vlog. But if you go, if you read down in the comments, so many of y'all inspired me to really say you know what fuck these job applications this is what i'm gonna do and i'm so grateful for y'all i'm so grateful for y'all the joe malone meet and greet their opportunity they haven't because of y'all i was so blind to my influence i went in joe malone literally to repurchase the body cream that i had been talking about in my vlogs simply because I genuinely loved the product. I went in there, I ended up meeting the store manager who immediately fell in love with me and was like, we need to do a meet and greet because you bring us so much business and we just want to be able to give back. And they take care of everything. I don't have to pay for anything. I didn't have to pay for the drinks. They had a, um, a bar, a a barista. They had a barista tonight that was serving wine. Um, they you know took care of the refreshments and things like that i didn't have to pay for anything they even let you know allow me to use their venue which is extremely nice it's one of it's one of the nicest joe malone storefronts that i've seen um i haven't seen many but it's one of the nicest i i, I love it and may the store manager and the other store clerks are just so sweet and genuine and funny and supportive and y'all I'm I just I'm just so grateful for y'all. I am so grateful for y'all. I couldn't I could not let this day go by and end this vlog without expressing my gratitude for my PayPal's. Like it, it's a handful of people that don't fuck with me. It's a handful of people that genuinely don't like me. They still watch, but they don't fuck with me. But y'all, man, listen. A special place in my heart, seriously. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much. Jersey!